this time of year the ground cover we're looking at a mix pri primarily this is Australian violets with the white flower picking up and you can see just a little bit of sweet violets with a purple flower mixed in and that's all self-sown that all just came over from that side of the house and that side of the yard and somehow it all migrated over here this time of year I really like the calla lilies beautiful white calla lilies they fill in a nice border behind right in front of the shed unfortunately during a like mid to late summer when they die off um, it gets barren and then through the fall and winter you know there's just nothing but dirt there um, because they die off but every spring and early summer they come actually come in they start growing back in like in winter so it's always a nice a nice display this time of year I put in this huge bed of Spanish lavender uh, we've got a dwarf variety which only goes about two feet by two feet and have maybe five or six plants in here and um, that replaced a previous lavender which was I think it was a uh, French lavender maybe an English lavender but you know it's like every couple years they, they die down and um, you know it just looks spotty so we placed it with this and I think it looks really nice my whole purpose with gardening is I'm creating a pollinator garden and I'm really doing my efforts for honeybee sustainability um, providing food nectar pollens for honeybees specifically and pollinators in general so as you can see my little girls here just love the lavender this lavender is absolutely gorgeous in here isn't it